Paul said, we have received grace for obedience and apostleship. Are you hearing me? We have received grace for obedience. Grace for apostleship. Say, Lord, give me grace for obedience. It, it takes the grace of God for you to walk in obedience to what he tells you. So the first step to walking in obedience to what God tells us is to cry to the Lord. Are you hearing me? To fill you with the word. What is the grace? Grace you can define as many, but here, whatever it takes for me to obey God, Lord, supply me with that strength. Am I making sense to you? And that should be one of the main prayers you pray every morning you wake up. Lord, give me the grace to walk in 100% obedience today as I go to my workplace. Am I making sense to you? The reason why we, our activities, we see very little result because many of us, our performance is in rebellion. It does not matter how many hours you pray, how many days you fast. If you walk in disobedience, that is just what we call a form. That is religion. Religion prides itself in activity without results. You are satisfied by 40 days. You are not satisfied that you see no results. You are not disturbed. You are satisfied because you have done five hours every day. But do you see the results for five hours in your life? If those things are not being, if the fruits are not there, then there's something not right. Am I communicating to you? Tell me if God cannot be bribed.